Bam! Sugar in your mouth. Yum, yum, yum. That certainly is wet bread. <laughs> Welcome, Welcome to the Kitchen and Jorn Show. Welcome to the Kitchen. Welcome. Welcome to the Kitchen and Jorn Show. That's Kitchen. I'm Kitchen. And that's Jorn. On today's episode of the Kitchen and Jorn Show, we are going to be trying every Target branded cereal. Of which there are, I think, 11. There's 11. A lot of these are granolas. I count that as a cereal. Yeah. If it's a loose amalgamation of sugar carbs and you can put it in milk, and it's a breakfast. It's, it's a, a cereal. cereal. Granola, in terms of like what it does for you, is it good for digestion or is that just oatmeal? I think it can be. I think granola is just sort of like, you know, it's like, what if we took all the toppings that we put on a Sunday and we turned it into breakfast? <laughs> <laughs> sort of what granola is. Obviously there are healthy granola. People are gonna be like, I make the healthiest granola I'm ever. I'm gonna tell you right now, I will never know anything Betty, about- Betty, no! She Sorry, was... she was chewing on a very expensive blanket just now. The dog's like, my life is so hard. I don't get to destroy their heirlooms. <laughs> And so the brands today are Good & Gather, which is like Target's, you know, kind of like food brand. And then some of the other cereals were Target's Market Pantry brand, which is another Target owned like... brand. And these are basically just like Target's dupes of like very famous, like other cereals. They're just like very generic versions. These are Bryce Kispies. They're Bryce Kispies. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. As you know, our rating system for videos like this, we go from just okay, pretty good, really great. And if you absolutely suck, it's penalty box bad. Blah, 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 blah. You do not want to be there. <laughs> so the first one is the Target Good & Gather Mixed Berry Granola made with whole rolled oats, whole rolled wheat, freeze dried raspberries, and strawberries. I would just get like enough for a little spoonful. I'm mixing in the strawberry because it's like a very strawberry heavy pour. Don't get mad at us for having two separate milks because Kristen needs to have milk without lactose, which is why we're not sharing. Yeah. I need to have lactose. You know, if she doesn't have lactose, she will die. What do you think happens after we die? I think after we die, we have to try all these foods all over again. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tastes like Special K. It's a little tart. The strawberries are very tart. I mean, I don't know if like, as they age, it'll, or like- <laughs> they age. I don't know, just, we put it in the wine fridge. <laughs> Granola wise, like the actual granola pieces, good texture, tasty. These are just okay. I think this is just the okay. The strawberry, the tartness of the strawberry is kind of overpowering. I think it's just okay for us. I think if you like tart things, I would elevate this to pretty good. Yeah. So it's, use your discretion. Your mileage may vary. Yeah. Um, but our mileage is, it's getting, our it, mileage it, is, we don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Target Market Pantry Cinnamon Oat Bites, a sweetened multi-grain cereal. First, I thought this was their uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch dupe, but I actually think this is their Cinnamon Chex dupe. I think this is Chex. Yes, it's Chex. This is Chex. This so is this not... is like life Chex cereal cinnamon dupe. Cereal may settle during shipment. Oh, so it's gonna sure. marry its high school boyfriend. Oh. Okay, this looks fine. Yeah, eat. let's try this Chex. It does not smell like cinnamon at all. No. Mmm. That's pretty good. It's a light cinnamon. What? It's not overpowering though. It's pretty good. And it's like a good ratio of like sweetness to like the Chex texture, the texture. They look like little packing crates. Yeah. But they taste like not like packing crates. I mean, I know. I know I've made that mistake before. <laughs> right, ladies? <laughs> you don't even know what you're like. <laughs> Yeah. This is really good. It's not too sweet. It doesn't smell cinnamon -y. But it does taste cinnamon. But it does taste, it does taste cinnamon. -y. So this is this is really great. <laughs> this is really great. Cinnamon oat bites. Cinnamon Cinnamon oat bites. Cinnamon, cinnamon oat bites are really great. Next. Maple almond butter granola. I thought it was maple. Almond brittle? No, I thought it was maple. There was maple, almond, and then also butter. But it's maple almond butter. Maple almond butter. That's a weird, a bad line break. Yeah, I definitely was like, why is there butter in this? No, it's <laughs> almond butter. All right, yeah, let's try the cereal. And I will great. say the scent coming from this bag is like super sweet. So that's a little- Interesting. But I also don't really like maple things. Why is there a whole almond here? I thought it was almond butter. I already have notes. How is this still tart? You definitely get a lot of almond in there. Is this still tart? It's not really tart. I just don't really like the maple flavoring too much. So there isn't a lot of maple. It doesn't really taste like anything. It's just know. okay. It's just okay. It's, it's like, just kind of like sweet. It's Sunday topping. Yeah. All right, what's next? <laughs> the Target Good & Gather Cinnamon Granola. Are we gonna learn in this video that we don't like granola? <laughs> I don't know. I love learning like really early in a video that like, I just don't like the category of food we're eating. Did that happen during soup? That, yeah. I feel like it's soup. soup we... It was like soups was bad. <laughs> also the wrap video when we got all the wrap from Trader Joe's. What was the video where it was so bad we had to start doing shots in the middle of it? Was that soup? It might've been soup. <laughs> 
All right, cinnamon granola. Cinnamon. Cinnamon. Mmm. Mm. I like this one a lot. That's great. This is really tasty. That's really good. Wow. Yes. Perfect ratio. Like it's yes. not too sweet. It's not too tart. The cinnamon is present, but not overpowering. I just like also just really love the crispiness. I don't know. This one just felt like a particularly good crunchy bite. Winner. Winner. Wow. This is really great. The cinnamon granola yeah, good together. So I think a big problem with granola is that uh, granola tends to be way too sweet. This is not. This is a good one. But it's also not tart. Okay. What's next? Honey almond granola. <laughs> Honey. This is the honey almond granola. Wang kids. No. No, but don't, don't switch it. Chris and I get like bits of song, of like popular songs stuck in our head, and then we just bastardize them until we're just singing like the worst jingles alive. Yeah. One kiss is all it takes eating this cereal. Yeah, yeah, yeah no. like, I, it does, it, like it doesn't go anywhere and it takes up a lot of time. Yeah. And yet, like, I and feel we like, infect each other with it. Yeah, and I feel bad because our editors have to go through this footage. And like listen to like things listen that to were funny like, to us like two weeks ago. Yeah, it's just- and not it, funny now. It's like, how do we turn this nonsense into a video? Anyway, let's try. <laughs> So this is a reference to the TikTok sound the of, dog. of FK Twigs' song Cellophane, <laughs> performed by Kermit the Frog. No, by Kermit by Miss Piggy about Kermit. Okay, you know what? Just eat <laughs> granola. <laughs> what is this granola again? Organic honey almond. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I'm getting the almond. No. Yeah. I'm, yeah. not, I'm not getting the honey, actually. <laughs> Maybe the honey is what makes it not so like, bam, sugar in your mouth. I would say the second best one we've tried so far. Yeah. I think obviously it's like, you know, number one with a bullet. Yeah. And then, you know, number two with like a oh, softball. <laughs> it's not a close <laughs> to, race. To a child who isn't very good at catching. <laughs> so this is pretty good. It's pretty good. This is pretty good. It's pretty good. I think because the honey. The next cereal we're going to be trying is the Target Market Pantry Toasted Rice, which is their dupe for uh, Rice, rice Krispies. Krispies. Yeah. Do people actually do people actually eat Rice Krispies or is it just kind of like a means by which to create like Rice Krispie treats? That's a good question. <laughs> I have literally not seen anyone eat Rice Krispies like this cereal since childhood. I don't have ever seen. We're not anyone. even eating Rice Krispies. This is toasted rice. You're right, toasted rice. We're like, toasted rice. Cereal. Sometimes I look at rice and I'm just like, mm, if only it were toasted. <laughs> they just don't cook it. <laughs> <laughs> Raw rice. If only, if only rice were hard, <laughs> not full of as much water as it should be. <laughs> oh, you can hear that sound. This is the off-brand snap crackle. Oh, yeah. Snip, tickle, no. tickle, and piss. <laughs> Wait, no. That certainly is wet bread. <laughs> this is fine. It's like not super flavorful. It's not really supposed to be, I don't think. Like it's just like, I think a nice avid, like a nice texture. Like that's mostly what you're getting. It's just kind of like, you know, a grain flavored cereal. It's, just not, it's not trying to do too much. So it's succeeding. It's not doing anything. It's just, it's like eating exfoliator. Like it's just not. I really, okay, I think the texture is really nice. And I think like, if you're having like a bad brain day, I could see where this has like a very yeah, important use. Yeah, I could say like, if you're having a bad brain day slash a bad stomach day, if you're just like, I need to get something in my body that's like basically chaotic neutral. Not yeah. bad. And I guess like these little like wet leaves are for you. Okay, the toasted rice, just okay. <laughs> just okay. It's just okay. It's just okay. It's, just okay. it's what okay. it is. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what's the next one? The next cereal we're gonna be trying is the Target Good and Gather Peanut Butter Granola. Ooh, that is pungent. It smells like peanut butter. Okay. <laughs> Let's eat this McFrickin... <laughs> frickin' granola. McFrickin' granola. That's new for McDonald's. <laughs> the McFrickin' chicken. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> a lot of peanut butter flavor. I like this. I feel like I would get sick of this because the only flavor is peanut butter. Like I would want a little bit more variety, but if you're into peanut butter, if you're just like, I love peanut butter, then you're going to be satisfied. <laughs> the dog is underneath us right now, like trying to get our droppings. <laughs> It'd be funny if you could see her, but you can't. So now you're trying to trust us. <laughs> the dog is just underfoot. <laughs> I'm going to refer to you because I'm not necessarily the biggest peanut butter fan. I love peanut butter. This kind of reminds me of like, you know, when you're a kid and you played soccer and maybe you weren't that good at it. I mean, but I remember you still, that. you still got a little treat at the end and someone told you a good game. And that's what this reminds me of. Oh, okay. So then, all right. Well, what do you think? You think like it's really good? It's pretty, pretty good. good. All right. Pretty good. Literally at this point, if someone gives me a granola and it's not like, it, like just burn my mouth out sweet, I'm inclined to give it the benefit of the doubt. All right. Well, I'm going to give her the doubt too. She's pretty good. Okay. Now we're getting on, we're getting to the funky granola. Yeah. This is like, I'm excited. Like the weird granolas. This one has banana in it. It's chocolate too. Ooh. 
chocolate banana. Okay. This is the Good and Gather Banana Nut Granola. It's made with almonds and dark chocolate chunks. A lot of chocolate. There's a lot of chocolate pieces. All right, you and get sliced yeah. almonds. I mean, I listen. I love chocolate. I do too. Why can I not get a piece of chocolate in this <laughs> spoonful? good. I think if you like banana, and like, I didn't realize I like banana. Apparently I do. I do. I mean, I eat banana. I eat, probably eat one banana a day and I eat it orally. Oh, you don't like, <laughs> you don't, you don't administer it some other way. <laughs> you don't administer banana intravenously yeah, or like just, yeah, you know, so, in your ears. I liked it. <laughs> I think it's a good balance. I think it's like, it's cause like dark chocolate's a little bitter, right? Yeah. And um, banana is like a little sweet. So like a little bitter, a little sweet, you know, it's kind of, it's a good balance. I think it's delicious. So the banana nut granola. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. This is the- blue Organic. Oh, blueberry. And flax. And flax granola. Ooh, look at that blue, look at that blueberry. Freeze dried blueberries and some flax. Let's try it. <laughs> Kristen, stop laughing. This is just blueberries. Hmm, blueberry muffin in a bowl. Yes, I agree. Do you want a blueberry muffin in a bowl, but like you're not gonna just like- Eat a muffin. Honestly, I feel like this is gonna scratch that blueberry muffin in a bowl itch, in case like you're not depressed enough to take a blueberry muffin and rip it into 50 pieces and, yeah. pour, and pour milk over it. Yeah. But you know, if you're not, this, is, this is a good substitute. Not, yeah, it's, and I'd say it's pretty good. <laughs> I'd say it's pretty good. Pretty good. All right, what's next? What's next? What is this? This what is, is this? the bean? vanilla bean granola. Okay. <laughs> I just saw bean. This is the bean granola. This is the bean granola. The bean. I don't, I just feel like vanilla. I feel like it's just gonna be a little boring, but maybe I'll be surprised. I mean, a savory granola actually would be quite delicious. Okay, vanilla bean granola. Mm, this is better than I thought it would be. I thought this was gonna be like too sweet. This is actually like very balanced. Yeah, I was surprised by the fact that I didn't find this to be overwhelmingly sweet. I thought it was gonna be disgusting. Yeah. Uh, Cause I was just like, I feel like to make the vanilla flavor pop, they're just gonna like overpower us. This is pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. Okay, all right. So our final cereal. So this is the Target Market Pantry Honey and Oat Clusters. Okay, this is mostly flakes so far. I'm oh, sorry. No, it's not your fault. It's, it, I'm talking about the cereal. Oh. I'm not, yeah. I'm not judging you for how you're pouring the Honestly, cereal. I was like, I don't know, I'll do better. I don't see a lot of clusters. This is a misrepresentation of the amount of clusters there, there are. There are not enough clusters. Not enough clusters. She just, this is cornflakes with special guest clusters. And whatever. All right, well. <laughs> okay, is there coconut in this? It tastes like it. All right, hold on, look at the ingredients. You're tasting the corn syrup and the almond. Oh, God, we cleared that one up. You're welcome. <laughs> also, apparently all of these foods have like satisfaction guarantee or your money back. Well, I'm not driving back to <laughs> <laughs> Did we just get a bad box? I think it's just okay. It's just, I don't know, it's overwhelmingly it tastes of coconut to me. And it's just kind of a weird coconut. It's not good. It's I know not it's a, not coconut. It's a bad dupe. It's a bad dupe. I think this is worse. I think this is penalty box bad. I don't think so. I think it's just okay. Nothing has been penalty box bad. I actually think none of these were penalty box bad. Okay. All right. I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll go with you on that. I think it's actually refreshing to have a video where we don't hate one thing. Anyway, uh, what was our favorites? I feel like I'm like giving an acceptance speech and I can't find my mom in the, okay, here we go, cinnamon. That's the closest one to you. <laughs> cinnamon! Cinnamon! This, this was delicious. Also, wherever those oat, the cinnamon oat bites are, that's good too. Yeah. Sometimes we have videos where everything we eat is like eh, and then sometimes we have videos where everything we eat has like a baseline of being like- Pretty good. Pretty good. And today was, was a one good, of them. It was a good day. Yeah, I actually found this refreshing. Thank you for watching, guys. Let us know in the comments what you'd like us to try next, and uh, we'll catch you on the flip. And tell Jen how cute she is. Oh, okay, bye! How cute she is! Okay, bye! bye.